Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Captator. So how are you guys? So today in this video, I'm going to tell you that how you can optimize your laptop for gaming plus streaming. As you know, I have a laptop. You can read the specs given in the description. So the problem is like streaming from laptop is quite tough. I can stream Valorant, I can stream CSGO. But if I try to stream PUBG and Warzone, it becomes a little bit laggy. PUBG is good, but I can't stream Warzone. But after a little bit changement to my settings, I am now able to stream Warzone at 60 FPS at a quality of 1080p edited 60 on YouTube. Okay, as you can see the video on the screen, this is the gameplay of Warzone on stream I am playing. Okay, so in this video, I'm going to tell you the best settings for your laptop. Uh, even for PC which will optimize it like it will give a perfect streaming quality and it will also give a perfect FPS okay so first of all go to your desktop just do a right click click on the display settings and make sure click on the graphic settings enable this hardware accelerated GPU scheduling enable this on and then you will see graphics performance preference okay so what do you have to do in this let me show you for example if you use streamlabs obs for streaming so let me remove all of this please one minute okay so for example like i want to optimize my valorant game so first of all find your valorant game wherever it is installed so now this is the valorant.exe open this add this and click on options high performance save same for warzone like let me show you for warzone like warzone is saved in battle.net games here and this is the warzone.exe click on options high performance save same for now let's talk about your streaming software like i use like i own stream elements obs and streamlabs obs all of them okay but for now currently streamlabs obs is good for me fine for me okay so i'm using this so first of all uh, add streamlabs obs then click on high performance save and after adding this just in the streamlabs obs folder search for obs 64 and add this and click on options high performance this is the first step you have to do if you want to optimize your laptop this is the must one okay make sure your laptop has enough power to cool himself because after these all settings your laptop might heat a little bit but like my laptop has a power to control its heating ability okay so whenever it gets like around 100 degree my cpu gets 100 degree it decreases my laptop performance and get it to like 85 90 okay so after this the second step is do again right click click on this nvidia control panel it will take around 5 to 10 seconds depending on your pc after that click on adjust image settings or preview in that select the setting use the advanced 3d image settings click take me there and your settings will open like this okay so let me expand it and let me show you what you have to do first of all go to this auto select okay or you can also select the high performance but i will suggest you to select the auto select option okay after that it is just copy my settings okay i am going to repeat my settings you can also watch the video again make sure that you don't do anything of the settings okay if you are going to change the settings please change it at your own risk and make sure you create a restore backup point if you want to do any experiment okay so first of all in the image sharpening click it on it set the sharpen to 0.5 ignore film grain to 0.17 ambient occlusion to off anisotropic filtering to application control anti-aliasing fx double a to off anti-aliasing gamma correction to on anti-aliasing mode to application control anti-aliasing transparency to off background application max frame rate make sure this is turned off okay don't make it like this on and 200 fps don't do this okay let me set it to back 20 i don't know why i'm doing this okay leave it cancel now cuda gpus all dsr factors of low latency mode ultra max frame rate of okay make sure max frame rate don't do this don't do it to 1000 okay just make it off okay mf double that is multi frame sample double a is off open gl rendering gpu select your graphic card here or auto select will be better but select your graphic card here then go to power management mode prefer maximum performance as i told you make sure your laptop or pc has a tendency to cool himself okay if it don't have a tendency to like my laptop has two fans and the fan speed is like 6000 revolution per minute of each fan okay so my laptop can cool himself easily so make sure if your laptop or pc has a really good system for cooling click on this prefer maximum performance or just click on the optimal power okay so do this at your own risk please 
then go to okay so guys leave it like as you know i have a laptop so i use an external monitor to play games fps games on it so ignore this one then go to seda cage because this is my monitor okay so ignore this so go to seda cage on texture filtering and tropic sample on texture filtering negative lod bias allow texture filtering quality high performance texture filtering try linear optimization on thread optimization or the triple buffering of vertical sync of virtual reality pre-rendered frames one virtual reality variable rate super sample off okay so these are the settings for minus 3d settings after like let me tell you uh, okay wait 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 wait, wait. After you are going to change all of the settings in the bottom right, you can see here. Just click on the apply button. Okay, then it will be applied. Or if you like, if you click directly here, it will show you like. Would you like to apply the changes? Click on yes. Okay, so I have already applied, so I will click on no. Then go to the third option that is set physics configuration. In this one, select your graphic card, not your CPU. Select your like in most like, like in every PC, it is by default auto selected recommended. Okay, so ignore that. If your PC or laptop has a good cooling one, already told you third or fourth time. Okay, telling you third or fourth time, make sure your PC or laptop has a great cooling tendency. Select this one, Nvidia. Uh, let me show you. Select this one, Nvidia G4 1650. Click on this apply button and then you can easily save it. Okay, so these are the best settings which will help you to give a really good FPS while gaming and also will help you to get a good FPS even streaming games like Call of Duty Warzone. Okay, so make sure to do these settings at your own risk. Make sure don't change any of the settings that I shown you in the video. Okay. So guys, at last I want to say that please like the video or if this video didn't work for you, feel free to dislike the video. Make sure to tell me in the comment section that does this work for you or not. Because I like every of, I want comment of every guy who is going to use these settings. Like if this is worth for him or not. Okay. So guys, make sure to like the, uh, like the video or dislike the video, uh, whatever you want. But make sure to comment. What I need is comment. Don't like the video. Don't dislike the video. I don't care. But make sure to give the comment so that other people can also get that. What is the reaction of uh, like you are going to give. Uh, uh, just I want is your opinion. Uh, opinion. Okay. Sorry. My bad. A little bit poor English. Okay. So guys, make sure to subscribe the channel. Hit the bell icon. See you in the next video. Goodbye.